Yo, what's up guys? How are you doing today? It is uh, Friday. It's the 24th of August. It's uh, winter today, obviously here in Cape Town, but behind me is a pretty uh, nice day. As you can see, it's not really uh, that cloudy. Let me just give you a good idea. The clouds are nowhere to be seen. So yeah, uh, I'm going to go get my hair cut today. Uh, the place that I'm going to get my hair cut, it's about two minute walk from the penthouse on Long. I'm going to be showing you where that is uh, shortly. And uh, yeah, I'm going to show you how much a haircut costs and pretty much, uh, yeah, compare it against the prices you pay back home and we'll have a good comparison. So I'm on my way to go get my hair cut now. It's about two minutes away from the penthouse on Long. It's just up the street. Very convenient place. Uh, yeah, it's very affordable. So I'm going to go show you what the place looks like and yeah, give you an idea of uh, the layout and how much a haircut costs. So I just want to do the same thing that we did the last time, kind of keep it short and spiky and kind of neat. Thank you. I must have fallen asleep at least like nine or ten times. Okay. All right. Yeah. Thank you. And this is my haircut. <laughs> okay, so behind me was the place that I just got my haircut. It's called the Barnett Hairdresser. Uh, cost me 120 bucks. Not sure what I think about it yet. But uh, yeah, uh, we'll see what uh, my girlfriend's response is to it a bit later on when I see her this afternoon. Otherwise, I feel good. Uh, I needed a haircut, so I've got one now. So I took care of that, didn't I? And uh, otherwise, yeah, it's still a very nice day. I'm looking forward to getting out, seeing my girlfriend a bit later on. So yeah. What are you guys doing on your Fridays? Let me know. Let me know. Yes, yeah, so as you can see, Cape Town's a really pleasant city. There's not really too much to make you concerned. And, yeah, nice, nice people generally during the day hang around, and a lot of tourists walking up and down Long Street. Thank you. Almost got in a bad accident now with a dude on a scooter. You should have seen his face. He just kind of like stopped there, and yeah, that was really funny, man. That was hysterical, actually. So yeah, you can find all sorts of wonderful art on the side of the road, available at most stores and things like that. And there's a lot of different shops and you know local stores and international name brands and things like that. But this is. Uh, some beautiful drums, beautiful African art that you find here available on the streets of Cape Town is quite amazing. It's all handcrafted and comes from all over Africa and these guys really, there's a story to tell behind each one of these masks and ornaments around Cape Town. You'll find a variety of African, uh, you know, art from all over countries. Uh, that date back with history from the beginning of time. Really, it's quite a, quite amazing. It's uh, unique to anywhere in the world, and definitely it's worth checking out one of the curios and checking out uh, what's on offer. Maybe take a present back to somebody in memorabilia about your trip to Africa. Beautiful, beautiful wooden carvings. Fantastic as gifts. Really light to put in your bag. And uh, yeah, just generally, generally quite affordable presents. So 
that was me, that was my trip uh, today for you guys. I went and had my hair cut so I can look more respectable and decent for my girlfriend. And yeah, it didn't really take me too long as you guys can see. I'm already here. I'm back at the penthouse on Long. I'm gonna say goodbye to you guys now and peace.